Carly Shimkus from Fox News joining us with what's trending this morning. 710 KURV Facebook and 710 KURV Twitter. Maestro, I got some audio for you. Let's go. Oh, yeah. All right, let me, let me check. Oh, I don't think I got the radio safe version, so you might want to bring it down, uh, Freddie. Carly Shimkus joining us on 710 KURV. So why is Kid Rock trending this morning? What's going on? Playing a little game of Russian roulette with that song, huh? <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, so, uh, some fans are angry with him because he's selling pro-Trump merchandise on his website. So he's offering T-shirts that say "Gods, Guns, and Trump," Boom. and a red baseball hat that says "Make America a Bad Bleep Again." <laughs> filling, filling that bleep. He, he's also selling. I some want other one. Yeah, he's also <laughs> Daddy wants things. one of those, man. Those are good. Okay. <laughs> on your Christmas list. <laughs> okay. He's also selling other things that are actual, actually very vulgar that I will not say here or else I will turn 50 shades of red. Yeah. Uh, and, and you'll get our FCC license pulled, yeah. So yeah. Let's, let's avoid that. Well, we this is nothing new for Kid Rock. I mean, this is kind of where he comes from. People should almost be used to it by now, right? Yeah, yeah you're right. I mean, he's a Detroit guy. He's, you know, this is his... It, it's, it comes as no surprise that this is his political affiliation. Right. But a lot of his fans that may have not known this about him are angry and have taken to Twitter to complain. Other people are loving the gear and saying they're buying it. Actually, Kid Rock tweeted about it and saying the reason why he's selling this stuff is because so many of his fans said that they wanted it. Yeah. So he's, you know, just bringing, bringing uh, the gear to the people. The, the kid from Detroit that... Uh celebrates the culture from the deep south. Yeah, that's right. right. <laughs> I just, yeah. I, I, that's America for you. Yeah, okay. I know. I like new kid rock. I don't like old kid rock. Like the rapper yeah. thing was not my style, but the country kid rock, I could get down with. All right. Uh, you got an example of a bad Santa. What, what's going on? Yeah, this Santa might need to write his own name on that naughty list. A North Carolina mother says a local Santa Claus made her nine-year-old son cry. The little boy asked for an iPod and a drone, but received some unwanted advice instead. He said this way off the hamburgers and french fries and that really just disrespected me, and I felt awful. Santa said that? Yeah. <laughs> Look who's talking. <laughs> Pod calling the kettle black, man. What's, how about you? It couldn't be more right. Rotten tarnation was going through his mind. So the little boy said that he tore up the picture he took with Santa, and he cried himself to oh, sleep. Oh, man, you're killing me. <laughs> you cheeky. Dog. I know. So Santa uh, apologized. I don't really think he's working at that that location anymore. Oh, man, that's... I can't go on. <laughs> I'm heartbroken. I, can't. I know. Just the thought well, listen, of that little kid crying all night. Just He's getting a lot of support today. He's getting built yeah. up a lot. So, so this was a lesson in... I guess growing some thick skin. Yeah, I need some comfort food right now. I mean, I'm, I'm so this I'm is on some... Facebook, YouTube, or where can we see this? <laughs> oh, yeah, all over. I mean, I'll, I can. It's all over okay. the place. Yeah, yeah. Uh, it's all over the place. Uh, I, I, I found it somewhere I'm on just, the internet. I just, I'm feeling so depressed right now. I need some, vi- I need some biscuits and gravy and some extra bacon right now. I just, right, right. I just feel bad. All right, so you got. I can see you gnawing on that <laughs> with a gravy dribbling down your chin with your Trump hat on. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's America right there. That's America. America. Bad bleep again. Yeah, uh, you got a new hashtag that's Trump related as well. What's what is? Yeah, that? well, so first of all, the reason this hashtag is trending, found on Trump Force One, is because uh, earlier this week Donald Trump tweeted about Boeing, saying that you know the planes, the government has a deal with Boeing, and the planes that for future presidents that they're going to make are just too darn expensive. So a lot of people are now wondering what could be found on Donald Trump's airplane. So. Found on Trump Force One began to trend. One person tweeting, Twitter on every device and screen that could be found on his airplane. Another writing, chalk for college students to write Trump Force One. Another saying, you might find Where's Waldo on his airplane. And another saying, you probably would find gallons of liberal tears. Yeah, so and, all those things. Could be and found gold-plated on toiletries everywhere. Okay. Everything gold-plated inside Trump Force One. All right, Carly, thank you much. Carly Shimkus from Fox News. What's trending? 710-KURV Facebook, 710-KURV Twitter.